Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel again. In this video, I'll show you Google DeepMind Code Vendor for your website, for your everything, like you are a coder or you are a coding project, everything you can use for your project. Now you can see here is the Code Vendor, all of the information, benefits and limitation, challenges, risk, all I have written here. So before you continue with Code Vendor, you need to read this or you need to hear from me everything about the update benefits strengths and everything so let's see what is the code vendor and how it works and what is the best benefits for code vendor using okay so before i am going to the topic let me show you one of the website that is helping my businesses top ranking pages showing and also helping my businesses seo and everything okay so you can see i already write in here the full information and if i show you here you can see the recent blog post option in 13 November, this tool is created for me one of the best blog posts for my website. Like I just integrated my site here and after that this tool is for my website SEO like blog post creating, blog post image generation, blog post title generation, blog post focusing keywords and also action and copy everything they are doing. And if I scroll down here, you can see here is the top optimized pages option. In the optimized pages option, you can watch the full keywords sophistication and also the action optimized content option and also the create blog post option. And you can see the focus keyword for each pages they are showing to me. And if you go to the AI recommendation option, you can watch everything in the AI recommendation option, you can see how many pages i have they are showing to me and also the recommendation fixing like on page like recommended fixes they are asking to me and also the title like how many titles i have in my website and also how many are approved right now meta description and you can see here is the heading one text internal linking images image title internal links everything they are showing to me okay so if you want to use this tool for your website SEO then I am recommending you to use this I am highly recommending you to use this in the rank analyzer option you can also use the rank analyzer option for your website so I hope you understand about this tool benefits like this tool is designed for the those people like those don't have the time to do the manual SEO AI SEO or everything or on page SEO off page SEO then you can use this tool for your website SEO like you don't need to do anything you don't need to spend time you don't need to do on page SEO off page SEO you can just integrate your site here and after that this tool will be done everything for you okay now let me go back to the topic the code mender topic okay you can see I already write in here the code mender information like what is code mender code mender is an AI powered software agent that is developed by Google DeepMind and also it is automatic detection patching and also hardening okay so and also it is just not a flag vulnerable it generate and validate pages and also it give you the full information that is worked for you okay and also it works both reactively like patching newly discovered flows and also preactively okay and also you can see as of recent reports codemender has upstream 72 security fixes okay let's show you the benefits for code vendor you can see in the benefits option they have the speed up vulnerability remediation and also the scales better than pure human approach and also they have the higher confidence through validation and also proactive securities and also they have the open source ecosystem support and also you can use arguments not replacer like developers like human oversight remains and also everything okay but this tool has some limitation if i show you some limitation for this tool and risk if you use for code generation this can be not public or general release and also they have the scope for language and support are unclear and also reliance on correct detection and they help the potential false positive and also over fitting and also human oversight must remain and also adversarial use and also trust transparency and maintainability okay so you need to focus on this risk as well okay so i hope you understand about that let's show you the full code mender website overview in the code mender if you search with code mender google code mender you can see here is the introducing code mender and ai agent for code security and you can see lots of information already there 
but we need to go to the deepmind.google okay you can see here is the build with gemini and chat with gemini you can use this deep mind in the tools option you can see here is the deep research option and also in the models of this deep mind you can see 2.5 pro they are using just gemini ecosystem and others and in the deep mind option you can watch this here is the google ai google deep mind google Naps, google research google gemini app and also the google ai studio if you click on the google deep mind then they will show you the full information about the google deep mind how it works and also introducing information everything okay so if you want to build with gemini this deep mind you can see they will give you the ai studio direction and you can see here is the all of the information for deep mind for google code mender and in the build option you can watch the full build option for the google deep mind and if you click on the plus icon you can use gemini others information and gemini 2.5 and here is the gemini information gemini 2.6 pro everything are there okay so i hope you understand about this code mentor information just code mentor is just about an ai agent okay and you need to use it for your google ai studio with gemini bo3 or google nano banana or others okay so you can see here is the bytecode and ai apps you can use it for your agent and also you can see here are the case we started with gemini by using python or javascript go java rest others option and you can see here is the view api keys explore documents and in the option all of the information are there so i hope you understand about the full code mentor process like how it works code mentor is in ai studio so you need to use code mentor under google ai studio okay so code mentor just an ai agent and you can see here is the settings option you just need to fix this and also you need to use your own card information for getting a better result from here okay because it's not totally free and in playground you can see live images audio gemini 2.5 pro basically gemini 2.5 pro is supporting code mender information and you can see here is the temperature option and everything thinking mode you can use it okay so thank you very much for watching i hope you understand about the code mender updates code mender information and everything so let's see in the next video